John Hughes was a Welsh businessman, born in 1814. He followed his father into the ironworks business. In the mid-1850s, Hughes moved to London to become manager and later director of Millwall Iron Works. During this time he was working on iron cladding of wooden warships for the British Admiralty. In 1868, Millwall Iron Works received an order from the Russian government for the plating of a naval fortress being built at Kronstadt on the Baltic Sea. He accepted the order, acquired land, formed the new Russia company and in the summer of 1870 set sail to Russia with eight ships with all the necessary equipment and about 100 skilled workers and miners. They set up eight blast furnaces and produced the first iron in 1872. Besides the ironworks and mines, he also set up brickworks and a railway line. Adjacent to the factory, a settlement grew which was called Uzovka after John Hoots. The southern part of the new town, which was built in English style was called the English Colony. John Hoos also provided a hospital, schools, bathhouses, tea rooms, a fire brigade and an Anglican church. John Hoos died in 1889. His enterprise in the town continued to prosper under the leadership of his sons. By 1913, the iron works were producing 73% of all Russian iron. After the Bolshevik Revolution of 1917, the Hoos brothers and almost all of their foreign employees left Russia. The trip was complicated due to World War I and some died when their ship taking them from Norway to the UK was torpedoed by a German submarine. The works were taken over by the Bolsheviks in 1919. The town of Hasovka was renamed first to Stalino in 1924 and then Donetsk in 1961. In March 2014, following the annexation of Crimea by the Russian Federation, a humorous campaign was set up advocating that Donetsk joined the United Kingdom because of the city's connection to Hus.